All right, here we go. Here we go. What do we got here? This guy again. This one. I think Michael's joining, but he's really taking his sweet time. Yeah, let's go. Uh. <laughs> uh oh, what up, Grandma? Tukili has entered the chat. Good old, our good old grandma. Chat grandma. Don't you say, I wasn't. I said, I was saying hello. Uh, yeah, there's poop on the floor. I just leave it there. Just where I like to keep my poop on the floor. Thanks. Appreciate it. Pa. Now I'm over here. Hmm. Okay, I gotta move things. I don't know what to take. We're probably just taking Wheel of Fortune. Like it's a draw seven. It's the most broken thing. This pack is kind of kind of meh. I don't know what's going on. There we go. That's better. We I'm did it. It sure is. <laughs> Old Chucky. Did you say aggressive marinara? Yeah, I love aggressive marinara. I know you do. Arabic, I don't know. I'm out. You guys asked for this, just so you know. I'm going to take Channel here. I do like Gristle Brand a lot. Do I like it more than Channel? I don't know. Channel's easier to play because the creatures are colorless. Yeah, but you have to get colorless creatures. You ever thought about that? No, you didn't because you only think about yourself. It's true. Got him. All right, it's one of these two. I'm going to channel it out. Whose mic is quiet? <clears throat> it's probably Michael because he doesn't know how to talk into the mic after probably like a decade. All right, we took channel. I haven't channeled in a while. There's a battle sphere. That's good with channel. So is Oracle of Moldiah. I'm going to take the Oracle. I don't think channel is the best. Um, all right. Maybe we're just trying the green deck here. Oh, that's a good one. Also worm coil. If worm coil comes back, which is kind of likely it might, no one likes a worm coil. I like worm coil. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. No, you don't. My favorite son. You don't have any sons. <laughs> I'm you're, trying to channel my inner. Your loins are barren, Michael. Well, you better pick that lawyer soon. <sighs> Yeah, she hates me. She hates me. She hates me. I'm gonna take Torsten. Uh ridiculous. It's very good. I like it better than this stupid hermit. Plus, if we can just easily get a white source, we can just do a little switcheroo on that guy. Could be could be a recurring nightmare here. I don't really care about Sakura Tribal. Once upon a time is pretty good with channel though. Once. It lets you get your big fat idiots easily. I don't hate Flesh Gorger. Actually, a Seagus Chariot's probably better. I, this isn't the, the best guy to, like, channel in on turn one. Whereas Chariot's just a good card. I woke the Hunter. Now he's in his undecided mode. I kind of just want to take Bayou. I bet Recurring Nightmare comes back. Fun fact. Bayou's a forest. I don't care. <laughs> that was fun. I had a good time. Yeah, I don't care about Thran Dynamo in the green deck, and I don't care about Elvish Reclaimer. I'm going to put this away. Channel Lightning Greaves, go. <laughs> that's, a, that's a solid turn. I wonder why my butt hurts. Is it just because I'm old, probably? probably yeah, it's probably because you got an old ass. Yeah. Yeah, of course there's pretty good here. You can play a turn four Courser with Channel. You just tap all four green and then Channel and then add one colorless and then you can play Courser with the remaining two green. You ever do that? It's a hard knock life, you know? No, it's an easy... That's a good play. It's an easy play. You just have the two cards and you do it. Sign me up. Okay. He's coming back. Yeah, he's just on a... He's just on a walking spree. I walked once. 
very good. I doubt it. <laughs> you don't look. You don't strike me as someone who's walked once. Oh, look at that little hunter emote. Oh, look at this. We got a noble hierarch coming back. All right, we're trying the green deck again. I used to love the green deck. No one would ever draft the green deck, and I'd always do very reasonably well with it. For some reason, I shouldn't have said that. It feels like I I can't even pinpoint why. But the common consensus is that the green deck just doesn't have what it takes anymore. And I don't know if I understand why that is. Terra Sunder is pretty good, especially with this Bayou. Is there like more removal now, maybe? I don't know. Fury is definitely rough. Oh, yeah. Fiery oh, Confluence is rough, but those guys have been in there for a while. Those aren't new additions to the cube. Fire, well, the elemental guy is kind of new, right? Fury. I mean, he came out like three years ago. Is it really that long? God. Modern. Horizons to release date. 2021. It's 2024 now. It's two and a half years ago. Damn. I guess it feels newer because it's been more in the limelight recently. Oh my god. Someone took the the worm coil? Just someone does like it. What a little bitch. I will find you. What's that little egg sucker do? <laughs> it's not good. Oh, God, I have to pick this. I'm sorry. That's fine. It, that's, it's not good. I'll believe you. It's fine. When it comes into play, you exile the top card of your library. You can play it until the end of that turn for two mana, which means like... So it does an egg thing, like all the other eggs, basically, but it's red. Do eggs do that? Well, like, when I say eggs, like cards that are in egg decks, like it replaces itself. It doesn't really do anything. Cards that are in egg decks. You know, like egg cards. It's like a permanent cantrip, you know? Permanent cantrip. It'll last forever. It'll it is a permanent forever. That is a cantrip, rather. No, it's a permanent cantrip, Michael. I do like a mox ruby. I wish it was a mox greeny. Green. <laughs> <laughs> I also couldn't remember it, so I went with the same joke. Here, we'll do this one. Am I so out of touch? No, it's the children who are wrong. What is my what is my little Fitbit telling me? Oh, it's just literally our our our. Katie family chat is blowing up. I think I'm just taking Mox Ruby. Blightsteel Colossus is good for the channel, but ain't nobody passing a Mox Ruby for a Blightsteel. Come on. Don't be stupid. Oh, it's Wallace. Hi, Wally. I'm taking the Ulamog here. That's exactly what we want with this Chinul. Yeah. Oh, I like a Misty Rainforest. It gets our it gets our Bayou. Nothing in this pack is any good for us. That dog. Yes, go ahead. Okay. Did you think he heard greenie and then he came down? And he's like, Oh shit, they got some greenies. Maybe. Wally's teeth are so bad, he so he needs like a hundred a day. <laughs> <That's>, <laughs> that'll work. That's harsh. Oh, I'm so sorry, little, little guy. His poor little teeth, you know. He can't help it. He can't brush them himself. Yeah, I wish dogs could brush their own teeth. They probably still wouldn't, but at least you'd know that they could. I'm trying not to pet him, but he keeps giving me his little hands and Okay, I'll pet you. What a little, what a little chief. I do have to find a way to play this Torsten. Add a planes to your deck. Smart. I guess we have Noble Hierarch. That's more smart. So done. And if we got like a Temple Garden or like a Savannah, we have a Misty. So that's nice. Also that Wheel of Fortune. Maybe we'll get... Like a sneak attack or something? We oh, we can cast that off our Mox Ruby now. So everything's coming up. Coming up us, you know? Isn't that red dinosaur, like, real good in that one deck or whatever? Yeah, he's real good in that one deck or whatever. He's got, like, fixed. Yeah, he's got fixed. Cas cascade? He got neutered. I almost said castrate. <laughs> yeah, he, he got fixed, the, which is... He, he got castrated. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I read that Wizards is making the interaction cheaper and better and lower rarity to address the power creep on creatures. Where did you read that? That sounds made up to me. What the hell? I didn't know that could come off. What the f Michael's little cup is just falling apart. I guess I don't really need that. I like Agaric, but I really like Oger Kaslam a lot. And I have not been able to cast this yet, and I kind of want to cast it now, so I'm going to take this guy over Garrick. It's got a lot of words on it. I do like Dryad. I think it's probably better than Liberator here because it lets us kind of ramp a little bit. It also gives us fixing for all these like random cards we might want to play. They didn't put the hot Dryad in it? The <laughs> yeah, this, yeah, I know. The you hot, know the, the sensual one. Actually, I have a copy right over here. 
Well, it's also just like the better art. You guys want to see the hot dryad? Look at this guy. Can you guys see it? No? No? Okay. It's working really well. well uh, it's it's this copy. Green card. Everyone knows, man. Everyone knows the hot dryad. They call him HD, you know? I saw on Twitter the other day that someone pointed out that red card Eno or whatever, the two-drop red that's real good, is just like kind of dark confident but better in a lot of ways. He draws you a card. And did they a bunch of other crap? Did they also take out? They took out Draga Tree Speaker, didn't they? That's why I, I haven't seen, seen it in like a year. That's not. That's not advisable. Ooh, a little tractor. Oh, what a little did to my boy. Triplicate Titan's not bad either. If we're gonna, if we're gonna channel, I think I might rather have the Triplicate Titan. <sighs> I mean, without exile stuff, he's pretty annoying. Nine is a lot, you know? Nine is a lot. Tracker's really good, though. I gotta I gotta kind of lean towards channel, though. Channel doesn't do much if you don't have big creatures. Wise words. Thank you. Well, they ain't coming from me. self got you. There's that Temple Garden we we're looking for. Also a Verdant Catacomb. Jeez. Oh, I boy. I think, well, I don't have any fetches yet. I think you take the Temple Garden if you do want to play the white guy. The white guy? Yeah, the white card. We also got Avacyn's Pilgrim now, too, bro. You don't even know. And Dryad. I think we have a lot of sources. I'm going to take the Verdant. I think what it's better. But that. What are you saying? Because, like, that's a free way to, to, to get a white is where now we, we don't have that. Like, what does a Verdant do for us that... We really need well when we get a savannah you're gonna be eating your words but that's the same that's the same pick but now we have a verdant we wouldn't have had that <sighs> you don't know anything about land <laughs> this is the mistake <laughs> i agree look i got double hierarch evil and good well you know what? that's not fair he could be a good little that's, guy yeah that was kind of shitty of you it was i apologize to the little guy judgmental af bro None of these lands are very good. Showdown maybe is a thing. I don't know. None of these cards... I'll take the Abrade. None of these cards are very good. That was a late Shallow Grave. Actually, maybe I should have taken the Shallow Grave. And then we can, like, get back one of these guys after we get we discard them. This is, I mean, this is a fine 17, I think. Give me that Lotus. Oh, Mox Sapphire. Double Mox deck. Neither are green. I'd like another big guy. Yeah, I'll take a Mox here. Sure. One more big guy would be good. I mean, Mox into any of these three and four drops is pretty good. I mean, I'm not going to... Island Mountain Plains. I like a Horizon Canopy. Retrofitter Foundry, is that any good here? It's good if we get Gaia's Cradle. No, I'm Moosem. I... <laughs> I like how you knew exactly what I was talking about. I mean, come on, how many how many moose? He's a moose. I hope this I'm gonna take I'm gonna take retrofitter and hope the horizon canopy comes back. Trion was also fetchable. What Trion was in there? Uh Jess guy. Yeah, yeah, but that's only that's only like one color. Man, Jimmy's always posting those food pics. It looks freaking delicious. Raging ravine. Eh, Devoted Druid's good. We can just take a Devoted Druid. I would take Excavator if we had, like, more synergies with lands. I think I'd rather just be ramping to, like, four and fives here. Like a questing Bizzle. Uh, Steel Seraph is... That card should be called Read It Again. I mean, at this point, if you haven't memorized all the questing beast abilities, like, that's on them, you know? That is on me. I don't, I don't, I don't play it enough, so... It's not really a commander card. Look, here's a Celestia Sanctuary. It's not as good. Yeah, I know. Library. I guess we play that? Mm, I don't think so. I don't think so. What about that hurts? Yeah, it's okay. It's fine. You can cast off channel. Sanctuary is interesting with like Dryad being able to play two lands. It does kind of help you if you miss a land drop like... Still move your lands forward. I think it's probably like one of the best options if like we get like a spelunking or something or like a also exploration. Does, does tap for white. 
That was she got that going. For that her. was the selling point. Katie posted a TikTok. Oh wow! In the chat. Oh my goodness! Let's see what we got here. I hope it's not. Oh my god. Yeah. Are you feeling kind of sad? <laughs> yeah. You're, yeah. This clip You're is just so evergreen. Sad that you lost all of your bubbles there. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty good. Oh man. Oh, Hoofy. Baby, are you feeling kind of mad? Oh, old Hoofy. Are you feeling a little sad? <laughs> I still wish Tooth and Nail was in the cube. Like, that's just... It took the two... Oh, man. It's, it hasn't been in here for, like, months, years. You massacred my boy. Just messed up. I guess if you take all the good green cards, huh? Prismatic Omen. Interesting. Nurturing Peatland. Interesting. Yeah. Is it the Bant one? I'll take the Bant one. That doesn't really do anything. Omen doesn't either. I think it's just Peatland here. It's kind of been a rough third pack. Well, that guy's alright. It's a Woody. It's the only real thing in here. Necromancy? Like, we don't know what to discard anything. Like, we just have Wheel of Fortune, but, like, I'm really... Not looking to go into a third color here. I feel like a currency converter would have really would have really popped off here. Wow, this is a terrible pack. I guess we'll just take Razor Ridge thicket. Sentinel and hope to get there on turn one. Rising Canopy came back. Alright, so we have plenty of white sources now. No, I wish we had the Sentinel. Michael, bring the bring big Christmas tree box whenever you go up there. Okay. I don't have my phone, so. Excavator. Sure. Not great, but we do have nurturing peatland and two two fetch and horizon canopy and two fetches. So and silent clearing. I guess we do have three of these sack draw card lands. It's funny because we're playing basically an Abzan deck with like Terra Sunder and Torsten. And the two moxes we got were Sapphire and Ruby, so that's nice. Is Ulamog our only removal? No, we have Terra Sun. I mean the green decks don't usually have removal anyway. Yeah, you just Put too much pressure. That's usually the, the game. I think I can hand to roll. Who needs removal when your opponent is dead? That's it. That's brilliant. We can also play Glimmer Lens and Endural now and just play Stoneforge. I kind of like that, actually. Actually, yeah. We got lucky there. That's not terrible. Grabbing some card draw. Ain't the worst. Uh, we got three cuts. Once upon a time worth it. Probably, right? Uh, I think we're cutting Retrofitter. We didn't get Guy's Slow. Cradle, so it's kind of meh. Uh, that's an easy one. It's a lot of big boys. It is a lot of big boys, especially without Natural Order. I think we can cut the Primus. Yeah. Plus we have Torsten. I think Torsten is better. And we have three one drops. We could. Mm. We have three one drops and a sanctuary, which I think is fine. Actually, yeah. With the sanctuary, I think that's not that greedy. Bio. Let's see. Smart Smart. Playing the bio? Because we have Terra Sunder and Wild Black sources. Smart. And it literally doesn't hurt our mana base. Well, there's no reason to run a non basic just in case if you don't need to. Just in case you don't need to. That doesn't even make there's any sense. There's ways to punish non basics in the cube, right? Maybe those are all gone. I don't know. Well, we can't search for a white here, but we have one, two, three, four. Probably do want one planes. We don't have a Rafello, so it's not really going to hurt us. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. <sighs> this is it's it's frustrating because Dryad wants you to have more mana, but like we actually don't have a ton of lands. Six, seven. It's fourteen lands, <laughs> plus two moxes. Good cut, Dryad. Swap for something else. Swap for something else. He's gaining you a little life, though. We got fetches. It's kind of good. Dryad gains us life? How does it do that? Does it not? No. I'm thinking of Corsair. Yeah. Which we also have. Yes. 
You probably, eh, I don't know. It's also really good on turn two if you get it. What is? Well, the Corsair of the Dryad, so it's kind of another reason to play it. Yeah, I think we can try this. I think turn one or turn two, any of these guys is good. Just play more faster. Smart. Smart. Good. Very good. 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 good, good, good. Is oh, I read that already. I was like, wait, that sounds familiar. I think it really is like a bulldozer. Uh huh. Sometimes you think he's a dog, but then he bulldozes, and you're like, oh, he does. And I see. He does in two ways. All right, we're doing round. Oh, that's pretty good. That's a turn two oracle of Mulduli. Terra Sunder is a fight card, I assume. What? No. Are you on drugs? What's wrong with you? Oh. It's pretty sick. That's a, that's a good one. 53 seconds of ads? God dang. I'll just hold my breath. <gasps> okay. I'm playing against Dan Hicks. You know who that is? Okay, it's good talking to you. Can't do it any longer. <laughs> oh, it's like 15 seconds. <laughs> I do not know who Dan Hicks is. I don't know either. God damn it. <laughs> I forgot he was holding his breath, and I was like, why isn't he responding? I wasn't prepared for that. God, that was terrible. I used to hold my breath for a long time. Well, Danny, Danny Boy Mulligan to Sixer. Were you getting lightheaded? Yeah. You think they're going to kill this guy in turn one? Probably. And then we're just not going to draw a fourth mana source for the Oracle? Sounds about right. Oh, they're green. It's looking good. Oh, Since yeah. didn't do anything. Oh, yeah. Come on, you son of a bitch. They were a son of a bitch. We don't really need that little guy anymore. I know. I want him I to go. I guess we can attack for three. Four, I mean, three? Those little guys add up for the crater hoof, though. That is good. Thank goodness. Well, that guy's coming down the pipe next turn, I guess. What is this, non-land permanent? Dang, I can't even kill their land, huh? I mean... No, we just don't have enough mana for it yet. No. Two, three, four, five. Oh, we got one. This makes how many squirrels? Makes four squirrels. Four squirrels? Forals, if you will. I mean, squirrels plus hoof is probably lethal, right? It's like probably. This is eight mana. Four. We have five. Where are you getting all the extra mana from? I guess we have six. Oh, what if we go? What if we just there's two lands under the sky? We have one, two, three, four, five, six. Where are you getting seven from? Well, you said five. I said seven. <laughs> I said six. I corrected myself. One, and two, then three, you're four, five, six. It's all one, in front two, of you. Three, you just got to count it. They they show it to you. They show you all the lands. Oh, for some reason I thought... You thought Oracle tap for two? Yeah, I don't, I don't know why. <laughs> well, tap for one. I don't know why. I just was like, that's the mana dork section. It must be mana dork. Jesus. <laughs> okay, we're never getting lands. Cool. Good. Good Oracle. I and mean, I'm putting nine power on the board, man. What more do you want? Lands. I'm like playing some kind of snake deck. Yeah, they're playing a snake deck. <laughs> <laughs> snake tribal. <laughs> this is my favorite snake. Oh, look at this. I tapped this. Untap. Thank you. We almost had an accident. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Well, if we get land, land off top, we can do it. No, I said that. I just said that like 20 seconds ago. <laughs> so focusing on the if snake. there's land, land under this guy, it's good. How's it going to be under him? Because he was on oh. top at the time. Mm. This is so painful. <laughs> but now there's a new card, so. Then it has to be under this one. Right. Oh, boy. I guess Chariot's actually just a fine card to draw. I guess. 
I mean, could you make the little the copies into Squirrel Master, and then that's pretty good, right? You could attack for like a lot. Do you know how? Do you know how this card works? Then Chariot make a copy of a token. Do you think this is rats? <laughs> Oh, you can it's like all coming together. You can all, you can see the gears turning as you go. I actually don't play Magic a lot anymore. It, it's definitely something you do have to keep up with, or else it kind of overwhelms you. What's that noise? That's the dryer. Mm, smart. Is that smart? <laughs> yeah, Mike on fire. He do big fire. <laughs> Oh boy. Oh boy, that doesn't do it, damn it. Oh god. What could this be? I don't think we're putting this into play because it's just terrible. It puts five power on the board, but like, I don't know. At what cost? Alright, sure. You got lucky. Does that kill some guys or something? No, it destroys an artifact or an enchantment. Don't care. Or they gain five, or they make a 4-4, four, four, or they put a shield counter on something. So I assume they're going to make a 4-4 four, four and kill our Sapphire. That's my guess. But that doesn't really do much. If I was them, I'd just make two 4-4s. Four, you can't. You can only choose one each. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, it's the washer. We got wrecked. Um, actually, it's the washer. Yeah, it was doing its spin cycle, I guess. That I was the probably go remove that, my that was the big from the dryer. No. Well, if that's what you'd like, I had a little. Oh, I gotta do it yet, though. Two lands underneath this chariot. Come on, one time. There's one. That's not gonna do it, though. All right. Well, I'll tap it. Play this guy. Bounce this guy. Play this guy. We did get an extra mana. What does the shield do? What does the shield counter do? It's it's like prevents damage, right? I can still exile this guy, right? Oh, just one shy. They'd be so dead. What? We're one shy. Sad. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We are one shy. This time I got it right. Hush, hush. I know. But I appreciate you checking because you never know. All right, we'll look up Titan of Industry. I bet that'll. That'll inform us. Put a shield counter, and it says shield is not a moon. You know, it could choose a shield counter. May still be destroyed by stapes action if damage is marked. If a permanent shield counter is dealt unpermanent damage, that damage you don't removed. They don't prevent players from sacrificing. Is it a destroy? All right. Get him out of here. Exile too powerful. Okay. Get your little nerd out of here. No, I was a big nerd, but... Well, they're pretty much dead next turn from Crater Hoof, so... We do need a land, though. No, we don't. One, two, three, four, five, six, right, seven, eight. this is a double <laughs> Well, right. two for three, you know? <laughs> I love that juice. What juice is it? This one's basically uh, brisk flavored. The Tell me about your juice. Raspberry iced tea flavored, if you will. Wow, I will. Mm. Ooh, that's a bingo. <laughs> From a little film called Inglorious Bastards. Perhaps you've heard of it. No. It's too bad. It's very good. Yeah. What a sucker I am for definitely never seeing that. Yeah, you sound like an idiot. Although I would, wouldn't mind rewatching that one. It's pretty good. It's very good. Oh, good. We're natural ordering. What could possibly go I'm wrong? I'm in danger. I don't think so. I don't think there's anything they can get. Well, if they progenit us and we don't... There's no progenit and they have one creature. Oh, they took it out? Oh, that's fine. Yeah, you're dead. Well, 
No, they're dead. I don't know about fine. Know. They're I'd, dead. I prefer it was like a noble high arc. I don't have a preference because they're dead. <laughs> so they've lost the game. Well, they're going to gain... They're going to go to 15. 15. This is going to give yeah. all our creatures 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, plus 8, plus 8. They're dead. It's actually plus nine, right? Because hoof counts itself. I counted it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, I thought you made four squirrels, not three. I did, and then I blo they blocked one. Mm. I, well, it's, just <laughs> it's all coming together. <laughs> my, I love streaming with Michael, but my least favorite part is having to like recount the entire match to him while we're playing. Is there any free shenanigans he could get into his hand that would cause us to suffer? Probably not. This is what they hit. It's like all lands and Nissa, a basalt monolith, and a bring the light, and a chariot and this. They're dead. They don't. Know, they don't know it yet, but they're dead. They chose Looks Nissa, like... bring chariot and forest. Actually, they might know they're they didn't dead. choose a creature. Wasn't Hoof on top at one or point? An art. I guess they chose. Oh wait, this is that's an artifact. That's a vehicle. So they just didn't choose a creature. Okay. What land? Nissa bring a secret forest. I think they're just trying to see a way out of this, but they, there is none. Well, they don't know we have this, so... Do we open with it? No. We drew it. Well, then we showed it on top. Wait. So they've seen it. Did they? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was one of the cards we revealed. I agree with you, but I don't feel like... Something's missing here, you know? I mean, maybe they're just drawing the line that, like, you just don't see that you can cast your spell. Oh, I see it. Oh, it's present. <laughs> oh, it's going to be so much. Oh, yeah, big dead. 10, 20, 30, 39, 49, 59, mm, 62, maybe? Oh, Crater was in our opening hand, wasn't it? That doesn't seem correct. I mean, it doesn't really matter. Matters to me, Michael. Roll the tape. Roll that beautiful bean footage. Roll. 10, 20, 30, 40, 53, 62. Yeah, I was right. Nailed Squirrels it. are tens. Buddy, they're tens, all right. Oh, yeah. He big dead. They gained seven. They gained seven. Squirrels alone. And they were like, I, I would rather him get a noble. I'm like, it doesn't matter. They're dead. You're just talking about degrees of death here. What if they got Which big is the name green of my... man, infinite life? That's not a real card. You don't know. And that's that they would come be out worse. With cards all the time. Do they? Yeah. All the time, huh? Apparently a set came out yesterday or something. I didn't even know. Yeah, it was Ravnica Remastered, which is it's pretty sick. You're double blocking this deep forest hermit. She has death touch, though. It'd only be cool if they print a card called King of the Rats, and it's the perfect commander that I've always wanted. Negative 38. I think we made it. Crater was in your opening hand. No. There, there was no lands on top. We, like, didn't hit a single land after we played Oracle of Moldiah, which is fine, because I guess you're playing gas at that point, but still. So they have Natural Order and Show and Tell. I would have liked to have those. Oh, the Brock Lesnar. Okay. So we got Chuck Liddell. Now we got Brock Lesnar. You could add Eddie Hall if you want. Who else has got that going on? That's all I can think of. Who's got it going on? This is interesting. If we hit a lane, like, this is a turn one pilgrim into turn two wall of roots or devoted druid. And if we hit a land, it's turn two courser. I think this is actually keepable, especially on the draw. Also, that swords make your guys a legit threat. It's pretty good. Yeah, I can even attack with this guy. That ain't a wall. That ain't a defender. Remember when only walls couldn't attack in magic? I was going to say, does that sword have a walls clause? Yeah, walls clause was Santa Claus's brother. <laughs> <laughs> so stupid. No. It's wonderful. <sighs> Merry Christmas. Oh, they got a one mana guy? Pringle. Got a noble hierarch? Arboreal grazer. Get busy grazing. Wall Yulem Claws. That's pretty good. Hunter's over there on the Ottoman. 
He only will, he will only go there if you're, if I'm not there. If I'm ever sitting there, he don't want to encroach, you know. I feel like Indian. You can get it. Okay, smart. No, I should probably just eat leftovers. You guys ever have this struggle where something sounds really good, but then you got leftovers and you're like, I might as well just eat these leftovers. How does chicken El Pastor sound? I gotta eat my own leftovers, though. It's like four and a half pounds of chicken. You can have some. <laughs> I, no, I know. It's not a matter of like, I don't want to take yours. It's a matter of like, I don't want mine to go bad. Oh, sure, sure, sure. Also, it could suck. I've never made this recipe before. Yeah. Although, it's like infinite garlic, onions, and pineapples, and pineapples. chipotles, and adobo, and a bunch of spices. Like, there's no way it'll be bad. I bet it sucks. I hope not. It was a pretty expensive recipe, actually. <laughs> Check it from a pastor. <laughs> yeah. It's been blessed. Hashtag. Blessed. Land off the top. Land off the top also lets us play both of these, which is pretty sweet. I got two fresh oranges in that biz, too. Let's play this for now. Squeeze by the hand. The oranges? Yeah. Wow. No seeds, because I'm a professional. Yeah, let's not go crazy. And I got the cilantro lime thing going on for the side too. Yeah, you really got you really just keep talking. There's just so much happening, you know. All right. They have two cards in hand and they went turn three bird of paradise. So I'm feeling okay about it. I had some tofu a la reverend tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Don't lie. How much is this? One, two, three. This is six mana. We can just go Nissa with no forests in play. Huh. It's, it's not very good, is it? So we can I mean, go one, it's... two, all of roots. This is one, two, three, four. We can actually go wall of roots into, into chariot. I think that's better than Anissa with no forest. Although she's pretty safe right now. She's safe. Chariot Resolvos. You're right. That was a lie. I actually had Umberger Helper. It's the best thing I've ever... I never know what's real with you. I never have any idea if the thing Stuart is saying is a real thing that happened in his life or if it's just a, a prompt for a joke. I'd like to believe it's it's a real one. You think he had Umberger Helper and it was the best thing he ever created? Yeah, it's his own famous recipe. <laughs> okay. It's a play on not burger burger. I'm burger helpers. It's real. <laughs> uh, Prove it. I'm trying to hit a land here. Pablo wants to land on top. Oh, that's a good one. That's oh, let's do it. Ooh, that's a bingo. <laughs> hey, there's a forest. This is nice. We're hitting all the lands now. Return a land. Give me that. Give me that thick. That is a worse land to have in hand, but you know. You gotta so do what you gotta we're do. one land shy of casting this guy, which means we could have played another land. But what are you gonna do? Let's crew. Crew it up. Crew with the boys. You ever crew with the boys? Sometimes. Me too. You know, sometimes you gotta fly solo. That's a bingo. Oh, what up? Soul Johnny. Oh, what is this? That looks pretty good. What is the meat in this, Stu? That looks that looks slapping actually, to be honest. It's just that's just a bunch of delicious vegetables and noodles and sauce and fake meat. That's true. Pretty good. My two favorite Sunday bingo boys. <laughs> Oh, old MMS himself. Impossible oh, Impossible Burger, Burger is actually legit. That's it. This looks really good. Also, I'm a big fan of, like, vegetables and food. As someone who's not vegetarian slash vegan, Impossible Burgers are pretty fire. They just taste like meat, man. Yeah. Like, I, to this day, think Impossible Whoppers are better than regular Whoppers. Did somebody say bingo? Oh. 
Yeah, I feel like I'm going to be sad that if if Burger King ever stops selling Impossible Whoppers, just because they're nice to have. And they've been had them. They had them for a while. I don't think they're going away. They must be, must be selling. You know. Like there's times I literally double check and I'm like, wait, did they give me a real one? They definitely don't cost three times the price. They cost like literally one dollar more. Also, often most of the deals you can, a lot of them you can swap for Impossible, so it doesn't actually cost you. Anything. Maybe it doesn't cost you anything. They always charge me. Yeah, it's because I got the racket where you pay for all my Burger King. You just don't know it yet. It's messed up. Luckily, I don't really take advantage of it too often. I barely ever go, but you it's know. Really nice of you. All right, so how much money? We've got one, two, three, four, five. We could play this Nusa. All my lands are for us now. That's pretty good. What's doing that? Dryad of the Elysian Grove. Oh, yeah. It's also got that ability. Ever heard of it? Yeah. Okay. Crew with Dryad. Do you believe me, though? <sighs> no. We're coming in. Coming in hot. It's Cyborg Huey. I, I, same. I feel the same. I don't know why it's better, but it just is. One, two, three. Get in with those kitty cat boys. I don't know if they could have that, that wrecks us here, but I'm sure they'll have something that wrecks us here. No, if they don't, they're dead. I mean, we got this crazy boy on top. You ever, you, ever, you ever had a crazy boy? Okay, Snapcaster just to just to block. Not great. This feels like such a waste of Snapcaster. Like, if you know we have Creative Hoof, like, what's this doing for you, right? Like, they're going to mill us. They're going to Thought Scour and put that Creative Hoof in the bin. Yeah, but then you just do that and then do it again because you get a little spell out of it. You know? That's a good point. You get a little spell out of it as a I'm treat. I'm just saying that feels like a complete waste of a card, but maybe he's got, I don't know, Living Death or something. You think he's got Living Death? That would be challenging uh, considering the colors he has. Do forest, I guess. Hoofed him. Well, everything taps for two. Every land taps for two now because of Dryad and Nissa, so that's pretty cool. That is pretty cool. It's like a it's like a build your own No, that's not gonna do it. No, that's probably enough. That prevents one damage. That's a good point. The part doesn't really do anything. What is it you say you do here? <laughs> oh, dang, it's a Mox Bruby. Luckily, that doesn't matter. Matters to me. I could have a fog, I guess. Was that five? Six, seven? Put counter on this guy? Bop him. Bop him? This is so much damage. This is going to be like negative 100. Do you think they're just they're just letting it happen so they can see how much damage this is? I would, because it's cooler. They got fog. They got cryptic command. I guess they could have cryptic. Oh shit! They got cryptic command. They're choosing the modes. That's brutal. Well, I mean, we're still in an okay spot. It's brutal. Look how much damage we were gonna deal. It's in it's incalculable. I bet you could probably calculate it. I'd I can't do it right now. Fourteen. Fourteen. Oh. Twelve. Oh my god, we're getting in there? Well, there's no like for there's not evacuation or something in the cube, right? And they don't have enough for what's the overload thing? Returns them all. Cyclonic that's not yeah. in this cube. Well they don't have enough anyway, so I mean I guess they could still have fog, but I don't know why they Tanked on the other part. You got me, buddy. Are there no fog effects in this cube? Not even the free one or, or the buyback one? Sorry, noob MTGO. Good luck. Yeah, no worries. That's fine. Like, people are, people are new at Magic. It's no big deal. My only hope is that as a newer player... He doesn't know how to concede so that all this beautiful damage will get through. Oh, I was right. It was over 100. 
dang. Negative 121 feels good. Oh, boy. I don't think he could block 21 damage. Look at Michael's arm over my head. That was wild. Oh, Oh. my God. We're going to get you here. It's like a shadow puppet. Is it? Is that what it is? All right. Round number dose. I will play first. Okay. We're one card away from from channel here and the card what's that little white channel. card do you don't even know god when a quick creature attacks mm-hmm. that's pretty good yeah it ain't bad we can play that turn dose or channel either one. Oh, they're playing something oh wow you usually have to have a channel in hand to play it I'll get it it's okay. right here bet Damn, Damn it. it. That would have been sick. Would have been so good. I mean, turn three Nissa is still pretty good. Yeah, luckily this time I got a forest. I feel like we're not good at drawing forests in particular. What's a forest? That's a good question. Oh, it just comes with a little guy? Yeah, that's what Formiridon is. Formiridon is the ability that makes a 2-2. Mm. Oh, what? It's the Glimmer Lens Mirror Match? Whoa. Got enough for that? I don't know what the equip is. Oh, uh, it's two. So we do actually. One, two, three, four, five. But then we can't attack with a second guy. So I think I'd rather just play Nissa, untap a land, and attack with both. And then you get the draw card. That's just pretty cool. I do love drawing cards. You ever draw a card before? Every day I draw that's, some cards. That's part of magic. Win the game or draw a card? Pfft. Draw, draw a card. card every time. I've lost games with Consecrated Sphinx because I chose to draw instead of just win the game. Where's Channel. <sighs> oh, they're just trading. That's fine. Oh, yep, yeah, they're just trading. I like it. Are you okay? Michael's slowly exploding here. I'm not sure if you guys can hear it because they're very quiet burps, but they're not trading. Okay. Well. Yep. This is a basic land creature planes elemental. Ever heard of him? Yeah. I should call him. We go way back. Sacred Foundry. You got it. Taken two? Of course. Selfless spirit. Ain't nobody got time for that. Channel. You got a new haircut, bud? Crater hoof. Is that a thing I can do here? Probably, to be honest. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, it is. 100%. But it is, an, is it enough? It'll be, they'll, they'll be dead. I guess even if there aren't, it puts them in like a really bad spot, yeah? Two, three, four. You big man. Five, six... Seven, eight. Hoferini. Nah, I love petting dogs. You like oh, dogs? They, they didn't even let it. Resolve. I mean, this is what? One, two, three, four, five, plus six, plus six? Like, they're dead. It's not even close. Oh, I thought you'd have more tap guys, but clearly I didn't do the math. No, because this is broken. What about the Ulamog? It's a great question. Cat dog. Cat dog. Don't know what we're cat dog. Is this a song? Yeah, it's a cat dog song. From the TV I'll be show, from the hit TV show Cat Dog. Yeah, I've been get demonetized for that. I probably did because I thought it was just a. I thought I accidentally played this show song. Well, yeah, I'm that good. Man, do you keep this in here? Because everyone's while I just do a little shot. Oh, yeah, a little shot of pepper flake. Yeah, a little pepper flake shot. That'll wake you up. This hand doesn't do anything, and I don't like it. I'm tempted to mulligan it. That's a good reason to mulligan. What does Chat think? Is this a mulligan? I'm mulligan this. Mm. Snap! What? You really? You you were no quite... no. I mean, mm isn't me like. Oh, I mean, we do need one more green. We we'll probably put back hoof, right? Yes, actually. I'm smart, man. Sometimes, not often, but occasionally. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Sometimes, not often, occasionally. What's going on back there? He's just doing his hunter thing, where he just tries to get into spaces he can't fit for some weird reason. I don't know why he does it. 
Okay. Ooh, baby. Well, here we go. The only thing better was if we top tech in Ulamog. I guess they are playing white, which would kind of suck if we channel and they just like path it. That would be really sad. It would be rude. Didn't... That would be tempting if we could do both. We cannot. It's probably still where they're in. Yes. Also, we don't have to pay that much. It's only a triplicate titan, Michael. What could it cost? <laughs> to be fair, everyone thinks they're always dead. They're not technically dead. Just this guy. That's all. Just a little 9-9. Nine nine. What's a little 9-9 nine nine as a treat? I wish for 9 mana it would be like, if it leaves the battlefield, you get that trigger. They said cute. I don't know if that's good or bad. Oh no, they're smiling. It's dead. Oh, it's going to be exiled. Oh, it's exiled. Oh man, they're going to kill it, then they're going to draw a card. Dang it. It's the worst. <sighs> okay, is they taking two? No, okay, that's good. Okay, this is all great. None of these are answers. Well, they're at least taking nine. I guess in their spot, if they don't have an answer, it's better than a... Uh... I guess they're just doing this to get the NT trigger. I guess that's worth it, because like, yeah, they blocking. can't win this race if they don't have a removal. And they're going to give pro colorless, which is fine. Okay, that's... Three passive hunter running into my leg. Will there be a fourth? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Wouldn't you like to know? I'll find out. Next time on Dragon Ball Z. Well, we can get a Bayou, which is nice. So I kind of want to get that now. It's wild that they're still making that show. Well, not Dragon Ball Z specifically, but you know what I mean. I almost like Terra Sunder a little better here. On like something. Actually, we can we can once upon a time see what we hit, and then tear asunder the glimmer lens if we really need to. Questing beast seems like a a beating. Let's take that guy, and next turn we can we can go on a little quest, and that should kill them. Maybe they just think it's a cute looking creature. I don't know. What's not cute is saying cute and not having the path. That <laughs> no, hmm. doesn't do anything. I guess it blocks. Does it does fly right? No, it just has lifelink. It does not fly. It don't fly. I mean, they're doing a good racing job here. Not kicking. Regular. No kicks. Not today, equipment guy. Ooh, no attacks. Fascinating. Well, they're not doing very good at the race now, are they? It's not very good, is it? So we attack with this guy. This guy can block. This guy can block. Then they give him pro. I think we just play this guy and attack with the, with the floaty boy. Maybe... Going on through. And if they don't draw an answer to Triple Get Titan, I feel like we're probably winning. Because that's how them being at two life works. I'm not so sure. I'll get back to you on it. Okay, let me know. It's got oh, enough trample, point. though, you know? Ain't that a bummer? What a bummer. I'm so bummed. Okay, they have one card. 
They're probably going to loot with this guy to try to hit like a path or something. That would make sense. Yeah, generally you want to kill your opponent's threats. Seems good. Maybe you do. Yeah, usually. Smart. Not always. Less smart. Hmm. Is tripling a titan? Oh, they're going to one. Avacyn's Pilgrim Lethal. Oh, God, what is this? Fury. That doesn't really do anything. That doesn't do anything. You might say it does nothing. Okay, it does nothing. I guess they can go to five, but it doesn't really... It doesn't look like 12 to me. I'm no expert here. What is this? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine? And they have no cards? Okay. They fought the good fight. I'm going to give them the good games because I'm sure they're saying something. Trip look it. Oh, we didn't even get to draw our card. We could have played a little Hermie. All right, we're 4 0 with the green deck. I don't know, man. Green is, green is good. <laughs> yeah, Gordon Greenco said that. I didn't really mean to do that, but then halfway through it, I was like, oh, I guess it's kind of. I guess of I'll just roll with this, this Wall Street quote. I meant to do that. Green deck wins. Not recently, but this time. If this is a if if you were buying a space heater, would you pick this one? I don't see why not. Because it looks terrifying. That's why. It's gonna melt your bones. <laughs> well, someone's got to melt your bones. You know. About your bones, you know. If we draw, oh, let's do that channel thing again that we did last game. That was fun. Is your name supposed to be like the gland? <laughs> Great question. <laughs> uh, Katie with the important questions. Yeah. I'm just trying to go to my next turn here. Our opponent's name is Roman Stomper. You know the thing that sucks about living where it snows? Tell me. It could be 4 p.m. It could be 9 p.m. I have no idea right now without looking at a clock. Yeah, you're right. I noticed my, I have night mode on Windows where like the, uh, the blue light goes out after the sun goes down. Mm -hmm. So a dude said, Hey, good luck. Have fun. Keep up the great content. Also, nice slideshow XM collection. Uh, I collect both as well as slabs. So, yeah, like usually most people don't know the companies that make um, like the statues behind me. We're just going to crack this guy and go get a bayou. But what if a scary man comes in the middle of the night and tells you to return the slabs? Hmm? It's a little Courage the Cowardly Dog reference. <laughs> return the slabs. I was like, what does that even mean? Trust me, for some people that's hidden right now, okay? Hit, hidden? Yeah. I thought you said hidden, and I was like, All right, what if they find it? You know, if you didn't play Magic and you sat someone down and you had them look at the two first basic lands played, you'd be like, these are two different games, clearly. Yeah, like with this versus yeah. like this guy? Yeah. That's sad. That is rude. That was really rude. So now we just have to draw channel. That guy's that guy's rude. Channel. That's not that's not what I wanted. That guy is rude. <sighs> mana crypt would be nice. Let's draw mana crypt. It's gonna be pretty surprising if you do. <laughs> I I agree. I would be like, whoa! <laughs> Vile Smasher. Land? Channel? 
Neither. I'm having a good time. Boy, killing this guy was a real back-breaking move there. Channel. Channel. Channel's actually pretty bad. Yeah, it's worse now. So we take three. Oh, God. And then we take three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, it's pretty good. I think I'm in danger. Oh. Remember that time we were 4-0? That was cool. We can... Well... What? We can, no, never mind. What can we do? We're not dead yet, you know? Oh, we're dead. I mean, in this match. Oh, it's present. Or game. I don't remember which ones are which, I'll be honest. Are you talking right now? Is it matches or games? Is the match the system or is the game the system? <laughs> if I have two wins, am I winning two games or winning two rounds? Michael says so much nonsense, but the way he says it is funny. So he gets kind of a little pass, you know? <laughs> it's match, though. We're, we're in match three. Smart. It's not like you get any more cool bucks if you 6-0 versus 5-1. Maybe you don't. Maybe I don't. Maybe I do. Who's to say? Yes. Wow. I'll keep this guy. what I miss? What did you miss? In our little chat. What's the chat? <sighs> What's a truck? What if the meta shifted so hard that green deck is the way now? Yeah. In like a day. Pretty good so far. I agree. Beautiful. Look at all this mana we've got. Mm. We can do everything. We can do magic. <laughs> oh, that guy again, huh? One, two, three, four. Play this. We have two mana left over. Or we can Andoral this guy and attack for like 100. It's got to be the 100, right? Yeah, it seems like it would kill him. So I'm on board. It should be on board. Posted me in my group chat today. Me teaching magic to brand new players. Seeing the cards... Seeing their face when I play Gandalf, Chris Pratt, Dracula, and Rainbow Dash in the same turn. <laughs> oh, wow. What problem is? I guess you could do that. Wild. I guess Chris Pratt isn't out yet, but... Yeah, he is. He was in the Jurassic Park set. Oh, okay. You're like, where's the Star-Lord card? No, Michael. He was in the Jurassic Park. Uh, no, Michael. That's later. <laughs> you're talking. You're thinking Chris Evans. Different Chris. No. Yeah, I guess you are still Maybe thinking either. Chris Pratt, but I was just trying to add another there's, Chris to the equation. There's many Chris's. <sighs> yeah, you know, I guess there is a lot of Chris's. And you did a, I, I didn't misremember that. There is going to be a Marvel set at some point, right? No, you must have just made that up. Weird. Mustard just made that up. Mustard just made that up. You ever attack for five in the air? They're dead. Not that I can think of. You can do magic. Look at all these spirits we got, man. They're at seven? They're about to be at zero. Or, or less. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I think they'll 10 here. It's pretty good. Or they can... Sure, you got it. You get my hoof, but then I get a... I mean, that's... It's coins for you. Oh, look at this guy on the top. What do we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight mana. So not possible at a, yeah? Gavna. So they block here. They take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. They just... They just died. They are just died... They're just died. They are just died. I guess this is definitely one of those decks that like doesn't look that great, but it's just kind of consistent. 
Ours? Yeah. What's wrong with you? I don't know, like a lot. Yeah, you ever you ever had an Emrakul attack you and then you block it with Jeff Goldblum and Blanca? <laughs> <laughs> Man, that is possible, I guess. What a world. So wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I don't think we're going to be able to make that, so I'm just going to play the land here. I should have played this guy first is what I wanted to do, but I think if we just alpha, they're dead. They have to block here. Then they take four, five, six, seven, and that leaves them dead. Seems to check out. Uh, not you, though. You can stay home. Well, also we're making two more spirits, so that's actually... But those don't attack, Michael. They don't? They haven't attacked once. Not none of the spirits? None of them. This seems like... If the creature as, that's attacking is legendary, they're tapped and attacking. Have you considered making it legendary? I thought about it. Stupid. It wasn't really for me, you know? No, this hand's great. <laughs> oh, brutal. <laughs> wow. I now see the message. That's interesting. Turn one lens, turn two oracle. Um, I kind of have to put back Nissa here. Yeah, I think it's got to be Nissa. Doesn't feel good to do it. I don't even have a second green though, so. I'm smart. You got it. I mean, we're going to empty our hand by, like, turn two, so. Uh, let's go planes, Mox. Lens it up. I'm actually going to play this here, too, in case they have, like, Inquisition or something. Or not Inquisition. Yeah, Inquisition or, like, Duress. Or Bat Boy or Pirate Man or... Bad boy or brief pie. or well, those take any cards, so they'll take Oracle. But I'm talking about the ones that would literally just take Mox. Mm. You understand? Duress. That's why I did say that. Yes. Thought sees. Mm -hmm. I ran out of things that do that. I didn't know I couldn't do that. I can't do that guy actually, so I have to play this. You can do magic. Do, do, do. Oh, we got a burden off the top. Good deal. You gonna kill this? We can also shuffle away that noble, which is pretty nice. Oh, I'm doing it. I'm shuffling every day. I'm shuffling. Bing, 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 bing. You know that jam? I think so. Okay. I think they're gonna snuff out my oracle here. Right, it's prime. I don't like it. No, sir. I don't like it. Unless you got to hit off it. It's true. Wow, that's worse. That is, in fact, worse. That's brutal. It's, I don't like it. It's not very good, is it? And they're playing a bow boy. Yeah, our pyrokinesis is good. It's real good. That's fine. This isn't drawing us a card, so. Well, they have two cards in hand. They're going to take our questing beast, I imagine. Let's yield until the end step. <coughs> oh, if they don't have a third land, though, that'd be interesting. Oh, this is very interesting. Oh, well then. Oh, one, two, three, four, five. I think that just plays out our land. Two mana planeswalker removal? Wow, that's really good. Yeesh. <sighs> I guess I'll tap this for two. That costs a white, though, doesn't it? 
That's unfortunate. Mm. Yep, that's pretty good. Wow, oh, that's brutal. Now we can't beast. Yeah, that's true. We can't beast. It's messed up. Oh, that's pretty good. That means we can beast. One, two, three, four. B -b -b Beasto. I'm just going to play this. Wish it was untapped, then we could equip. Really? Jeez, how much removal do they have? Not all of it. <sighs> cool. Well, we get to draw a card, and now they get to take Torsten. Which we would have been able to play next turn. Yeesh. They've had, like, the perfect answer every time. Yeah, that's pretty good. Now they just attack for six and take our Torsten. This is terrible. Fantastic. Now we get to draw another card. They'll probably take that somehow, too. Yep, that's a good one. That's a good replacement. No. Congrats on Pyrokinesis Bitter Triumph Belfle Mastery. Must be nice. Seven doesn't do anything that six doesn't do. I think we're just blocking here. Brutal. That's not terrible. Of course, we can't equip it, though, because we are one land shy. Well, it's fine. We take three, I guess. I'm not convinced we'll ever untap with the creature, so... Okay, that's fine. They have no cards in hand, so that's good. All right. Finally. Jesus. <laughs> That's not very good, is it? Okay. So if we equip here, they don't block anything. They just take four. And then we take one, two, three, four, five, six, and go to one. Hmm. That is a thing, isn't it? I think we still have to, right? And what else do we have to do? We can't block this guy. Yeah. And if we do survive, we get uh, some cre some creatures. It's too bad she's a legend. Well, I guess that wouldn't really matter too much. No, they would just be attacking. Yeah. I'd rather have them untapped, but... That would be really cool. I I'm agree. sure they'll just, like, lightning bolt us or something, so... Oh, equipping the Glimmer Lens is actually not great, because then they're just going to shoot us with Bowmaster and kill us if we draw... I was excited to get the extra card, but now I'm less excited because of Bowmaster, so. Yeah, this match felt like it was going really well with this first turn Glimmer Lens, second turn four drop, and they just had removal for everything, so. Yep, that guy is lethal. Mm, yeah, Shadow's pretty good here, huh? Great. Okay, well, fantastic. Really matter, guys. All right, two, two, one with a green deck. I'll take it. Could have been bet. worse. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Be sure to do all the things, and uh, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching, guys.